Okay, in this video, uh, you're going to get some instruction on how to draw a point, line, line segment, and ray. So first I'm going to start with a point. A point is pretty simple. Um, we draw a point like this. It, it looks like a period. So it's just basically a dot. And a point represents an exact location in space. And so this isn't the best one. I'll try to color it in a little bit better, but if you can remember that it looks like a period, then that is a point. And a point can go on a line. A point can go on a line segment or a ray, and it, it represents a place, a spot. And so usually, um, almost always, you're going to label a point with a letter. And, and so, in this case, this is point A. And... <clears throat> In a real-world example, you may see points on a map. And if a point was going to represent an exact location on a map, it would maybe represent a city. So its label would be um, a city. So if you were looking for Sturgis, a lot of times on a map, Sturgis would be labeled as, as a dot. It would be a point, And then the label would be Sturgis. So... Um, we'll move to the next one. The next piece is going to be a line. Now, a line is a straight path that goes on forever in both directions. So a lot of times we talk about um, lines in our daily life. Um, I'll ask you to line up. Uh, in a line and really that's not true um, because our line does not go on forever uh, a line never ends and it's a straight path so there aren't any curves now this I realize that this is not perfectly straight um, and without a ruler I can't really make it perfectly straight um, but a line is a perfectly straight path and it goes on forever in both directions. Um, it's really hard to find an example of a line um, in the universe. And so, um, just because it, it goes on forever. And so, that's, it's pretty difficult to find. Um, but, in any case, lines have points all over them. And you could put points anywhere, but I would name this line if I if this was point A, and this was point B, I would name this line line AB, and so I could either name it line AB like that, or I could also name it line AB like that. So next we're gonna we're gonna see a line segment. A line segment is something that is a little more um, a little more applic applicable to our lives because when I ask you to line up, what you're really creating is a line segment if we're in a straight line, and so a line segment has an two end points. So I would start here and this would be an end point and I would have my line imagine that this is straight and it would have another end point and so I could name this I'm gonna switch it up and use my initials this time and this is line segment NH so you could either name it like this, line segment and H or you would you would name it like this. Just a simple line segment and then put N H underneath. And that shows me that's line segment N H. Well the big thing that, that's a difference between lines and line segments is that 
lines are a straight path that goes it goes on forever in both directions. Line segments have two endpoints, so it does not continue on forever. So these are line segments are things that we're going to see in our daily lives um, way more often. Um, but many times we actually call them lines when in fact they're really line segments. Um, line segments are going to be found in a lot of two-dimensional shapes that you will start to learn in the next few days. Um, the last thing I'm going to show you today is a ray and a ray is a straight path that has one endpoint but in the other direction it goes on forever and so one example of a ray that I could think of right now is light and so it has one endpoint but it goes on forever in the opposite direction and and many times on rays we have multiple points this will be x point x and this will be point y so this would be named ray you could name it like this ray x y or you would spell out the word ray x y so rays are uh, another example of something that you may not see very often um, but I would imagine that um, if you think of a laser pointer um, it starts at one end there's an end point there and the laser goes on forever in the other direction also the sun's rays um, start at the sun and they go on forever so these are rays line segments lines and points and hopefully you can use this video to help you um, with some upcoming assignments that you have and your understanding of these concepts